The next few videos are going to be building on top of one another, so following these steps carefully is key. So in this video, I want to be talking about Brave Browser. I'm sure many of you have already heard of this browser. It was voted even in 2019 to be one of the best privacy-oriented browsers to date by Forbes and many other groups. Some other people do like Opera, if you like that option as well, if you want to check that out. One of the main reasons I like Brave is, and I use it over Chrome, which I used to use, for many reasons is one, because it's free. Two, yeah, I can earn a little cryptocurrency by using it. You earn basic attention token, that is BAT, B-A-T. Um, nothing crazy though, maybe $5 a month if you utilize it, but that's not why I use it. Um, the main reason why I use Brave is because it integrates with a lot of the cryptocurrency sites, because it is obviously based off of cryptocurrency, integrates with the wallet seamlessly, unstoppable domains, MetaMask, you name it. And also because there's no more spyware and tracking like on Google Chrome. The best thing about it that I like personally is, of course, you can actually import all of your bookmarks, your whole user interface from Chrome while actually maintaining your privacy and control. So if you guys want to use the link below this video, download this to your you know, corresponding device that you have. And then what we'll do is when you open it, we'll actually kind of play with this and you guys can look at this. So I have my Uphold account. This is another exchange, Uphold, as we can see right here. If you've not created an account, feel free to do so. It will definitely be recommended. Obviously Uphold is working and doing some great things specifically right here. You can see their debit card uh, for cryptocurrency. And this is just Uphold.com. So if you want to check that out and create an account, that would also be a mandatory step. Um, before kind of collecting rewards for a bat, basic attention token. So when you download Brave, you can go to your settings. And as we can see, you can profile name and icon, you can make it dark appearance, whatever you can import your actual bookmark and settings from whatever browser you used to use. So if you did used to have, you know, Chrome right here, I can import all of my stuff right there. Super, super convenient. I'm a big fan of it as well. Um, color theme, you know, just anything that you would typically see with the browser. Um, once you import all of your extensions and bookmarks, it makes it really feel like home. Same interface, um, and honestly, they do say, of specifically people from Brave, that it does save more battery power for your computer as well. And if you wanted to be rewarded with basic attention token, you go to Brave Rewards. And then right here in my Uphold account, I just have 100 bat tokens, so about $24 worth. I can add funds, and I don't currently have ads on, but if I turned ads on, I could actually be basically paid micro amounts of cryptocurrency for watching ads within this browser. So just another option, guys. Wanted to mention this, and the reason why I'm talking about Brave is because it's going to build on top of the other wall integrations I want to show you, and typically a lot of things that people are curious about in the cryptocurrency space. If you don't like Brave, that's fine. It is completely free to try out. I recommend trying it with the link below. If not, you can stick with Google Chrome. You can stick with Safari. Or you can check out another one I've heard great things about. I've used it briefly, but I'm kind of stuck in my ways, and it is called Opera. So feel free to check that out as well. Um, figured I just want to give you guys options. So for this video, download Brave Browser. You can connect everything and also get verified on Uphold.com. All right, now another thing I like also, as we can see on the right, crypto wallets. So if you did have a MetaMask extension, this is just one a little Ethereum wallet I have with $7 on it. Um, you can, as you can see in the top right, the MetaMask extension. And this is what will be key, and I'd recommend you guys download that as well to get started so we can work on the next step. 